Hey everyone, this is Young with Nosh Finder. Here at Nosh Finder, we bring you unique snacks from around the world, break down those flavor profiles, and make sure to stay till the end because I am gonna give this snack a Nosh Finder rating to determine whether you should try it or not. If you haven't subscribed, be sure to show your support and subscribe to my channel. In this episode, we are celebrating National Cheese Pizza Day on September 5th with these melty cheese Calbee flavored chips. I actually got these chips from a local Japanese supermarket, but I also saw that you can actually get these on Napa Japan as well. Let's dig into some nosh facts to see the origins of pizza. The word pizza first appeared in a Latin text from central Italy, which was still then part of the Byzantine Empire in AD 997. Fast forward to the 18th or early 19th century, modern pizza evolved from flatbread dishes in Naples, Italy. Pizza was brought to the United States with Italian immigrants in the late 19th century and first appeared in areas where Italian immigrants concentrated. The country's first pizzeria, Lombardi's, opened in 1905. Pizza is a popular fast food item in the US. The pizza restaurant industry is worth $37 billion. <laughs> I'm definitely a contributor because I do love pizza. 13% of the U.S. population consumes pizza on any given day. The combination of sauce and toppings seem limitless. Common pizza toppings include ham, mushrooms, olives, pepperoni, and sausage over tomato-based sauce or white-based creamy sauce. In the U.S., distinct regional types of pizzas were developed in the 20th century from deep dish Chicago style to hand-tossed thin crust New York style pizza. Based on our bag, looks like the pizza that we will be reviewing is going to be a pepperoni cheesy pizza. So let's open these up and see how it tastes. What pizza flavored chips have you tried before? Leave a comment below and I actually might put it on my channel. So um, I have these Calbi Melty Cheese Pizza Potato Chips. It actually has the Italian flag along with very oversized looking chip with these melty cheese words melting onto the pizza chip itself. And it has this delicious looking pizza on the side. And when I flip it to the back, and the ingredients include potatoes, cheese powder blend, some spices, garlic powder, tomato powder. So I'm definitely excited to try these out. So let's open it up. All right. So if I look at the chip, so it has a ridges type of chip and I like the weight, like it has, it's kind of lightweight, but it doesn't crumble in your hand. And it's definitely not greasy too, which is like what I really like. And I love the ridges because it actually traps some of the flavorings. So, oh my gosh, whoa. I just noticed that there's actually some melty cheese on it. So the package does not lie when it says melty cheese. It literally has melted cheese on the chip. So super excited to try this out. This is really cool. Ooh. Cheesy pizza. I definitely smell cheesy pizza, like a pungent cheese. So like a aged cheese, um, bits of Parmesan, Pecorino Romano, cheddar cheese type of smell. Don't really smell mozzarella or like pizza mozzarella smell. A little bit of tomato and some Italian seasonings. So let's try this chip out. Mmm. I gotta say, it tastes like pizza. So I like the texture. It also has the flavorings trapped in the ridges itself. It's not greasy. It um, has a bite to it, but not like too crunchy. So it's actually really, really great in terms of the texture itself. It has um, kind of like pizza seasoning flavor with a bit of the Italian seasonings, um, the tomato sauce, and then the cheese. Not really like mozzarella cheese. It's kind of just like a little bit more like cheddar cheese, Parmesan type of taste. Um, and the little thing that's kind of weird, it's not like salty pizzas, like combos, but like more along the lines of like a little sweet tomato sauce. So not exactly full pizza flavor with the saltiness and the cheesiness and then all the seasonings, but it's a little on the sweeter side. Otherwise, it's still a very delightful chip, great texture, some good seasoning on it, and it's really cool that it actually has the melty cheese element. So I would give this chip a Nosh Finder rating of four out of five. So if you want to try these out, definitely go to a local Japanese supermarket or go on Napa Japan and pick these up yourself and try it out. Thanks again for joining me here today at Nosh Finder. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to click those like buttons. If you haven't subscribed, make sure to subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at Nosh Finder. You can check out all my other videos too. See y'all next time on the next Nosh Finder. Bye everybody.